And another one. All right. So what's this scenario? What if we get off the whole numbers for a second? Here it's all been real, real nice. Well, I got something for you. What's this? X to the minus one. Oh, boy. not quite sure. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna tell you something. You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? You ready? If it's raised to a minus power, you're gonna say that that's one over x. Cool beans? The beans are cool. And here's why. If I take a look at this guy, one over x, I could rewrite that as x to the zero. What's x to the zero? Oh, it's one, fun. x to the zero over x. Now what do I have? I have the same base and I'm dividing. So what am I gonna do to their exponents? I'm gonna subtract. Sure. Um, if it's not written there, it's assumed to be a one. That's fun. But wait, there's more. This is x to the zero minus one. All right. What's zero minus one? It's x to the minus one. Yeah. So algebraically, they are equivalents and that's my Next rule. And that's all we need for now.